Hi guys, it's Miss Kelly here. I know you can't see me, but that's because I really wanted you guys to be able to see the pictures today. So your screen should have the full page of the book today. So I'll just be reading in the background. So today we're going to read Wacky Wednesday by Dr. Seuss. And that is because today we are celebrating Wacky Wednesday. So let's read this story together. And on each page, we're going to stop and see if we can find all of the wacky things. And trust me, there is a lot of wacky and silly things happening in this book. Let's begin. Wacky Wednesday by Dr. Seuss. It all began with that shoe on the wall. A shoe on a wall shouldn't be there at all. Then I looked up and I said, oh man, and that's how Wacky Wednesday began. <gasps> Look at that shoe on the ceiling. I looked out the window and I said, gee, more things were wacky and I saw three. All right, friends, take a minute and look on the page and see if you can find the three wacky things. All right, let's go through them together. First, look, we have some bananas growing upside down in an apple tree. That's super wacky. We also have a worm chasing a bird. Usually birds are the ones eating worms, not worms chasing birds. That's silly. And then look at the bottom. We have a hose that's not connected, but somehow there's still water coming out of the sprinkler. How silly. Did you find all those wacky things? All right, let's keep going. There's a lot more on this Wacky Wednesday. I went down the hall and I said, hey, three more things were wacky today. All right, let's see if we can find three more wacky things. Well, look at this. The picture is upside down. That's silly. Oh, look over here on the table. There's a candy cane as one of the table legs. I've never seen that before. And how about this? Two doorknobs for a door? That's certainly wacky. In the bathroom, more. In the bathroom, four. All right, friends, see if you can find the wacky things. Oh my goodness, look at this, a goldfish in a jug sitting on a shelf. I sure don't have that in my bathroom. Check this out, a sock in the shower? You wouldn't wear a sock in the shower. Oh no, look over here at the sink. The faucet is upside down. When you turn on the water, it's going to spray into the air. That's super wacky. And then the biggest one of all, I'm sure you all saw this. A big palm tree coming out of the toilet. That's just wacky. I began to dress. Then I said, wow, four more things were wacky now. Oh boy, now back to the bedroom. There's more wacky things. Let's search for four more. Let's look, friends. <gasps> we have another shoe on the ceiling. These shoes are popping up everywhere. We have a shoe stuck under the bed. Look at this, guys. A broken chair leg, but the chair is still standing up straight. And this one was a little tricky, but if you look at the clock, the clock numbers are out of order. The 12 should be at the top of the clock, and the 6 should be at the bottom. If you have a clock at home, take a look at it, and you'll see what it's supposed to look like. This clock is not right. It's wacky. I looked in the kitchen. I said, by cracky. Five more things are very wacky. Let's take a look in the kitchen. Let's find those five wacky things. Look at this poor little bug. He's holding up the refrigerator. I, I don't know about you guys, but I don't have that in my kitchen. <gasps> now look at this over by the cupboard. We have six coffee cups hanging, but look. One is floating in the air. The other five are on hooks. There's the sixth one just floating. 
look at this. There's an umbrella in the pot. If you look at the kitchen table, part of the table is missing. And then take a look at this. There's a mouse chasing a cat. That doesn't seem right. I think cats are supposed to chase the mice. Very silly. I was late for school. I started along and I saw that six more things were wrong. <gasps> go ahead and see if you can find six wacky things. We're gonna go through them together. Way at the tippy top of the page, it might be a little hard to see, but look, there's a tree coming out of somebody's chimney. That's certainly wacky. Check out this house. <gasps> the stairs are supposed to be under the door, but the stairs are shifted to the side. If you open that door, you might fall. You need the steps under the door. Look at the pink house. There's no door at all. That's the third wacky thing. Now look over here. There's a window floating in the middle of that person's yard. That's silly. <gasps> look at this. Normally, we don't see tigers in baby carriages. We normally see babies. That's silly. Okay, that was five wacky things. We need one more. <gasps> Take a look at this. If you look at the guy in the car, he's sitting in the back, but he's driving. Usually the driver is in the front. I've never seen a car like that before. That's silly. And then seven more. Okay, we need seven on this page. Let's go through them. Check this out. Part of this house is missing. Take a look in the sky. Have you ever seen the sun look green before? I sure haven't. What's a shoe doing in the middle of the road with a bird in it? That's wacky. Oh, look at the telephone pole. It's just floating there. It doesn't it doesn't go into the ground like the other poles. That's silly. Now look at the stop sign. Normally, or the traffic light. Normally, green means go and red means stop. You guys know that. But on this traffic light, green is stop and red is go. That's mixed up. Look at this guy driving. He has a shoe on his head. I've never seen that before. And then look at the guy sitting behind him. His legs are sticking out the bottom of the car. That's silly. And the Sutherland sisters, they looked wacky too. They said, nothing is wacky around here but you. Oh no. Let's take a look at the Sutherland sisters. Some of them look a little wacky. Look at this one in the middle. She's missing her legs. And this one, look, she's missing part of her neck. That's silly. But look, I yelled, eight things are wrong here at school. Nothing is wrong, they said. Don't be a fool. Wow, eight things on this page guys let's see if we can find them look at this a turtle stuck up in a tree I've never seen that look there's a shoe hanging out of the tree too see this sign on the yard it says fur sale not for sale it says fur sale like animal fur speaking of fur we have two tigers sitting in the classroom we don't have any tigers in our classrooms at school. Just kids. That's silly. Speaking of the school, that sign for the school, that's not how you spell school. School is spelled S-C-H-O-O-L. Not O-U-L. That's silly. Way at the tippy top of the flagpole, there's a shoe up there. These shoes keep popping up all over the town on Wacky Wednesday. How silly. Look at the American flag. Now we know what the American flag is supposed to look like because we always say the pledge at school. The stars are supposed to be in the smaller spot and the red and white stripes are supposed to be in the bigger spot. This flag is mixed up. Oh boy, look at this. Part of the flagpole is missing. There's no way that flagpole could stand up like that if a whole section was missing. I ran into school. I yelled to Miss Bass. Look! Nine things are wacky right here in your class. Oh boy, now we're in the classroom. Let's find those nine things. 
Look at Mrs. Bass. She's not wearing regular shoes. She's wearing what on her feet? Roller skates. Have you ever seen your teacher wear roller skates during the day? I sure don't wear roller skates to school. I don't want to slip and fall. That's wacky. Check out the bottom of her desk. Another shoe. Now let's look at the chalkboard. This one was a little bit harder to find, but if we do the alphabet, we know it goes A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Not Z, Y. This person did the alphabet wrong. Let's keep searching. Oh my goodness, look at this girl. She's standing on that boy's head. That wouldn't be comfortable. This one's a little tricky too. This poster on the wall, it says George Washington. George Washington was the first president of the United States. But that's actually not a picture of George Washington. That's a picture of Abraham Lincoln, a different president. Super silly. That'd be like there being a picture of you with a different name under it. Look at this guy. He looks like an old man sitting in a classroom. That's silly. Oh, that guy who's getting stood on? Look, he's not even sitting in a chair. He's just squatting. Look at this guy. He's not even facing the right way. His desk is totally backwards. And look at this kid. He's, he doesn't even have a head. How silly. Nothing is wacky here in my class. Get out. You're the wacky one. Out, said Miss Bass. Ooh, let's find a couple wacky things on this page. There's a couple. Check out this poster. Still wacky. Now, friends, take a look at her phone cord. Look at it. goes, it loops into her plant, and then it stops down here with a mouse chewing on it. I don't know if she'll be getting any phone calls today. I went out the school door. Things were worse than before. I couldn't believe it. Ten wacky things more. Wow. All right. See if you can find the ten wacky things. Let's go through them together. Look at the flag. It's super mixed up. The stripes are in the right place, but now they're blue and white, and there's pink where there should be the stars. Oh, another shoe on the bottom of the flagpole. Look at this. This kid is walking an alligator. I've never seen an alligator on a leash before. Look at this building. It's just floating. Check out this statue. Look at the person riding the horse. Is he facing the right way? No, he isn't. That's super silly. Look at this guy sitting on the park bench. Normally the benches are on the grass, not in the water. Oh my goodness, this lady walking the baby, she's walking the baby in the stroller on top of a car. Oh my goodness, this tree is growing out of a shoe. Oh, there's another shoe on the hood of somebody's car. And look at this, my favorite animal, he's sticking his head out of the manhole in the road. How silly. Then I counted 11. All right, guys, see if you can find 11 things. Here we go. A chimney coming out of a tree. Look at this tree. It's yellow. All the others are green. Look at this lady. In her stroller, instead of having a baby, she has a tree coming out of it. Speaking of strollers, there's no baby in this stroller. It's an alligator. Now this sign, it says for sale, but the word for is spelt like the number four, F-O-U-R. It should be F-O-R if it's for sale. Look at this door. It's on the building sideways. Up in the sky, there's another shoe on the chimney smoke. This one's a little hard to see, but if you look really closely, in that stroller is an old man. I've never seen an old man in a stroller before. It's usually babies. Check out this stroller. There's no wheels. It's just floating. This stroller has a ski on it. And this stroller only has one wheel. How silly. 
Then, 12 worse things. I got scared, and I ran. I ran and knocked over Patrolman McGann. Let's check it out. 12 things on this page. The window. Look at that window. It's just floating up there. A door in the middle of the sidewalk? That's silly. Look at this stroller. It doesn't have wheels on it. It has shoes. And this lady, she's not wearing shoes. She's wearing wheels. How about this? A tiger pushing a stroller. Up in the sky, there's an airplane about to land in the road. A car. Look at this. There's a ramp in the middle of the road and the car is floating and hopping the ramp. Look at this. A baby pushing a grown-up in a stroller. I've never seen that before. This stroller's upside down. Look at this. Just random shoes in the middle of the walkway. Maybe it's an invisible person. Oh my goodness, look at this cow. It doesn't have a head. It has two bottoms, but no head. Take a look at this pig. It doesn't have regular pig feet. It has chicken feet. Oh my goodness, have you ever seen a stroller with so many babies in it? There's got to be 50 babies in there. That is a lot of wacky things. I'm sorry, patrol man. That's all I could say. Don't be sorry, he smiled. It's that kind of a day. But be glad Wacky Wednesday will soon go away. Look at Patrolman McGann. He's got a shoe on his hand. And look at his police badge has a shoe on it too. That must be the Wacky Wednesday symbol. Only 20 more, only 20 things more will be wacky, he said. Just find them and then you can go back to bed. Okay, friends, we only have 20 more things to find. Do you think we can do it? I think we can. All right, let's start looking. Way up at the top of the page, look, there's a road that just floats right into the sky. I've never seen that before. Speaking of the sky, two suns. Have you ever seen two suns before? I haven't. Look at this, another floating house. Oh my goodness, now the airplane is driving on the road with the cars. That's silly. Oh, a car floating in the air. I think the car should be on the road and the airplane should be in the air. Look at this, a woman uh, pushing her stroller in the middle of the road. Oh my goodness, look, we have a tree and the tree is missing a part of the trunk. A chimney floating in the air? That's silly. Over here we have three houses stacked on top of each other. And look at this. This woman's pushing a baby, but there's no carriage. It's just wheels and the baby is floating. All right, that's ten things on this page. We're halfway. We need to find ten more. Check this out. A fish who's fishing? I've never seen that before. Oh, another shoe, and there's a bush coming out of it. How silly. Another stroller with feet. A pig with no feet. Look at this lady. She's just sitting in a chair in the middle of the sidewalk. Oh my goodness, this lady pushing a stroller doesn't have a head. Oh my goodness, Patrolman McGann now has three legs. Take a look at the sidewalk, it's all rolled up. Look at this guy sitting upside down on the bench. How silly. And I think there's one last thing to find. Look over here, a bush with a wheel under it. I've never seen that before. <gasps> Wacky Wednesday was gone when I counted them all. And I even got rid of that shoe on the wall. Wow, guys, that was a super silly story. 
Were you able to find all the wacky things? I bet you were. You guys have an awesome, wacky Wednesday. I have one more thing to show you. Take a look. Happy Wacky Wednesday! Oh, who's that? It's Miss Kelly, but I'm a dog. There's Mrs. Pendergast, and she's a dog too. Oh my goodness, Miss Leslie's a dog. And Miss Sarah's a dog. And Miss B is a dog. And even Mrs. Ferdinand? Wow, this really is a wacky Wednesday. It couldn't get much wackier than that. Oh boy, I guess it could. Now Tank and Lulu are the teachers, and the teachers are the dogs. How silly is that? Super silly. I hope you guys have a great wacky Wednesday. We miss you. Bye.